So the play is a sort of fractured and sprawling story. Um, it's got lots of characters who inhabit different circles and worlds, but in very close proximity. So they're all connected to each other, um, but they don't necessarily know that they are. It's lots of interlinking stories. Um, one is that um, a homeless woman wants to get a tattoo. Um, another is a homeless woman who's in danger of being uh, evicted from her shelter. Um, so a lot of them are to do with uh, people's past mistakes and their regrets and how your past stays with you um, in your present. We have uh, a burden, which is where the albatross title comes from. So uh, the, the idea of the albatross around your neck and something you, that you've done that you have to carry with you through your life. So I've worked with our brilliant designer, Roz, um, and we've created a set which means that everyone can be on stage at once and we can have this um, sense of people being feeling isolated in a crowd. Um, and she's created a space that's uh, sort of like a community hub and a space that could be um, any of those, a homeless shelter or a living room or um, a tattoo parlour, but also could just be a space where you'd find a group of actors. So developing the play with the students, um, it's definitely changed over the course of probably a year or so um, and I think that was a great process for them to be involved in as well because they usually would work on a published uh, text um, and it was great to be able to hand over that sort of freedom to them and I just think it's a it's a great project to work on because as well as having the support of the college we've got the support of our commissioning organisations as well and it's great to have so many people um, who can offer their expertise um, as well as working with amazing students from the college.